Hello, we are at the Advanced Hyperbarican Recovery Center here in Vancouver, British Columbia. Uh, in front of us we have Michelle who had uh, finished a round of 40 oxygen uh, therapy treatments and is just visiting. Uh, Michelle, why don't you uh, tell us your story, how long ago you did your, your treatments and what you came in for and how you, uh, how you responded to them. Okay, it was uh, a little over a year ago, so I was here in May and June of 2009 and I had a herniated disc at C6, C7 in my uh, neck and as a result of that I had some spinal cord compression. So there was pressure on my spinal cord. And what were your symptoms? And the symptoms were uh, nerve pain and weakness in my hands and uh, in my legs. So I had difficulty with my balance and with strength and coordination in my legs. And uh, were, were you able to walk or run or uh, were you uh, having trouble with any of uh, any of the gross motor skills? Yes, I did have trouble walking um, quickly or any kind of balance of stepping over things, walking up and down stairs. I had to hold on to the banister uh, for support. And I could walk but uh, slowly and carefully, but I felt extreme weakness in my legs. Okay, and then you did our one month intensive uh, intensive program, which included hyperbaric oxygen therapy. Uh, any other treatments uh, that were included? Yes, I did uh, some Myers cocktails, so I had nutritional therapy, as well as um, the infrared sauna treatments. Okay. And at the same time that I was coming here for oxygen, I was doing spinal decompression as well as an adjunctive treatment. Excellent. Now, previous to that, you had done uh, a round of spinal decompression, and how did that go? Uh, it was really successful in eliminating uh, my nerve pain symptoms, but I didn't see any uh, results with the balance coordination and loss of strength in my so hands and legs. So this time we thought we'd do the whole program together. And now, uh, uh, what happened after the, uh, after the month was over? Uh, when my, I completed my oxygen treatments, I, I had some minor uh, improvements in my strength and coordination. But it wasn't until about five weeks after the uh, treatments were finished that uh, all of my strength came back. So I had an extended recovery period after the treatments ended and that's when I noticed uh, the results and I, I completely recovered from my injury. So it took, uh, it, it took five weeks from the end of the course of treatments to get the full recovery and now it's one year later and how would you, uh, how would you say, have you seen any regression or are you still at a, uh, at a permanent state there? still at a permanent state. In fact, I've started up running again. Uh, I was a little concerned about